Today, we're going to bring an M.2 heatsink. We're going to take a look at it and we're going to install it on the motherboard. So let's go ahead and see what you get when you get something like this. All right. So we get a nice and pack with stainless steel uh, on this part of it right here. And this is actually going to be the mount with the actual uh, adhesive, which it has the thermal tape installed. All right. You're going to have to put that in there. Uh, there's another one here that they give you. Let me see if they give you the other one. So they give you a couple of them, right? So in case you mess up once or twice, they give you three of them, right? And um, three colors, three different colors. Well, two two different colors, right? So these are the adhesives that you need to install on this heat sink. And let's go ahead and pop it out. Well, there you go. This is the actual heat sink that you have to install on the M.2. So this pretty much just goes over it along with the actual thermal tape. So, and this covers the whole thing. So not bad. All right, let's go ahead and set it up. So we're going to put a thermal paint, um, a tape on the bottom of it. All right. So we're going to do that right now. All right. We're going to put this in here first. We're going to make sure it's, it's secure. All right. So we put the double sided tape in here. And of course, we're going to need a clearance on one of them. Right. And then just remove this part of it. Right. And we're also going to put adhesive on the top of it. And we're going to put this place however you want to want it. And you see the little bottom part. That's how you want to make sure you cover that part. All right. So that's where the actual screw is going to go in. Uh, once you have it in place, then you're able to drop in the actual radiator. All right. So we're going to go ahead and lock it in place. And we don't want to cover too much of it because we want to make sure that we're able to lock it in place. And then once we do that, it just locks in and that's pretty much it. All right. So we're going to set up the actual M.2. I put the razor here and, the, and then all we got to do is lock it in place. And if you guys see, I'm going to get my screwdriver in here. And we got plenty of clearance now because uh, I actually moved some of the adhesive to the back. And all you got to do is just make sure you... You tie it down and you're set. So that's set up in our motherboard already. All right. Very easy to use. I hope you guys enjoy the video. 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel. I hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful. And I hope you hit the like and subscribe.